been for those who haven't subscribed, please do. And my returning viewers, thank you so much. And today I have brought you another interesting video. I'm a teacher. So, guys, yeah, in here, Chitagata Hot Springs is also called Chiriba Chafumba. This is in a Kasese language. This is their native language. This is of Kasese. In Ukonza, they call it Chiriba Chafumba, which is called Hot Water, Hot Springs. So I'm going to read, and they said, Welcome to Chiriba Chafumba Hot Springs. So I'm going to read you about the originality of this Chiriba Chafumba Hot Springs. Chiriba Chafumba Hot Springs also known as Chibenge, are valued by the Bakonzo. Bakonzo, this is a tribe in Kasese and other ethnic groups for medicinal and spiritual purposes. So these people believe in spiritual things, spiritual traditions, and also they believe in medicine. So they think that when you go to the spring, you will be healed. For them, they think so. So their waters facilitate the healing of the skin, diseases, bone-related ailments, and general body weakness. Spiritual leaders, donators, and religious leaders cleanse themselves here before performing the rituals. So they have certain rituals they do here in their tribe, the Bakonzo. So this is, this is what I'm reading, that keeps the local communities thriving. Engaging in immoral behavior such as fighting, sexual activity, destroying the natural landscape, and blaspheming the sacred names of the spiritual beings of the Bakos, especially the water de deity, are seen as desecrating this site. Often, as risk punishment by the spirits. This is what happens at the hot spring. This is the hot spring, and this is what happens. So, if people are seeing even the like bathing, some of them they are cleaning their bodies, their skins. So, offenders risk punishment by the spirits. They believe in spirits that are called so, uh, which may affect them or their relatives today and in the future. The site is often affected by the flooding of the seasonal Nakavingo stream. So, there is a a stream around here, it is called Nyakabingo Nya, Nya stream. So it's often affected by the flooding of that stream during the rainy season. Efforts to protect Chiri River Chathomba from destruction have engaged the local community. Residents have distilled, distilled the drainage and constructed a temporary structure with changing from so residents the community works hard in hard to work on the hot spring so that it can not be affected by drainage and everything the obusinga warenzululu obr in collaboration with that so obusinga warenzu it's like the, the kingdom of renzuru non renzuru they call it renzuru so their kingdom is called renzuru obusinga warenzuru they, in collaboration with the Cross Culture Foundation of Uganda and the local council of Nulembia Division have also mob mobilized the community to plant indigenous trees to increase the site's vegetation cover to develop a magic management plan for the site and to provide information materials such as, such as this board. You can see this board. So that's the, the, the of Singapore Renzu, which they do. They work hand in hand with the community. So they have here a regulation. Please respect the site as part of this community's culture, identity, and heritage. So that's it. That's the originality and all about of Chitagata or Chiriba Chafumbu Hot Springs. So you're going to follow me.
helping them themselves to clear their skin diseases. Hi people, we are heading to another hot spring. This is a road heading there. <laughs> it's just a small road heading to another hot spring. <laughs> it has even a hut. <laughs> This is just, uh, this hut is in the middle of the uh, forest. This is a fishing pond. Guys, these are the bubbles that uh, make the water to be hot. You can see the bubbles. So I've gotten someone to explain more about the hot springs here. This water comes from underground. Mm -hmm. which is called mm -hmm. Yes. This hot has all minerals. Mm -hmm. That's why it heals. If you have stomach pain, yeah. it is the stomach. And uh, it has all minerals like magnesium sulfur. Like what? Asham, magnesium sulfur, calcium, and other sulfur. Okay. Is it too hot? Now, why is it going the other side? This floor just my process for water fights when it is on level. Yes. That's why it's so the other side, how about the other one, the other hole you dug up? The other, one, the other hole is another source. Mm -hmm. It's also, we dug it just, just for young people. Yes. So you're, you're, you're reserving it for the young ones? The young ones. To do what? Mm. It's another point. Mm. You have three points, that one mm. and the other one. Yeah. Yes. So this point, this one, the one you've shown, this one, it is for the minerals to forgetting and you drink and you yeah, get you some drink. minerals, yes, yeah? We drink from here. From here where it's bubbling from, yes, yeah? From. Okay. Where we drink from. Okay. <laughs> hey, you tell them to subscribe. Hey, they'll be coming. Okay, thank you. <laughs>